What's up guys welcome back to yet another video so finally we have good news for oneplus nord users oneplus have started rolling out oxygen os 12 open beta 1 for oneplus nord so in this video let's quickly take a look what all changes oneplus have done with oxygen os 12 for oneplus nord so without wasting any more time let's get started so here i have my oneplus nord which is currently running on the first beta of oxygen os 12. so here you can see android version is android 12 which comes with 5th March 2022 security patch and if you talk about the version, version over here is F.09 and this update you guys won't receive it via OTA so you need to manually update your device. What you have to do is first download the file given in the description below so all the files you guys can find it in the description below including downgrade file. So if you are downloading the file from your device itself there are possibilities that file format would be .zip .jar. In this case, you need to rename this file, long press on it, tap on these three dots, tap on rename and from the end, remove .jar extension. Later save the file. Once done, just copy this file from the download folder and place it inside the root directory of your device or you can say internal storage. Avoid placing it inside any of the folders. Once you are done with that, then you can just head to system update section select local upgrade from there once you do that you will find a file which you recently downloaded and placed it inside internal storage tapping on it will give you a pop-up to take a backup though the data won't be wiped but for safety purpose make sure to take a backup installation process might take around 5 to 10 minutes once it's done reboot your device and also guys to get better performance and less bugs for once perform a factor reset from recovery once you update your device so now before moving ahead let's keep a like target of 500 likes on this video and still we have 80 percent of users who haven't subscribed to our channel but they do watch our videos so if you guys find our videos helpful do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video and one of the major change what are you guys gonna see after updating a device to oxygen os 12 now most of the google applications will adapt to material you theming part so here you can see the colors of google dialer which have adapted the colors of wallpaper so the same thing goes with chrome as you can see here and other applications like messaging app so this is one change what are you guys gonna notice on oxygen os 12 though this was not present on oxygen os 11 and it's not a specific feature from oxygen os 12 it's just that google have updated all their applications which supports material you now now let's talk about the launcher so you guys gonna miss oxygen os launcher now on oxygen os 12 you'll get the launcher from color os though it's a good launcher you have lot many customization options there are few gestures by which you can just swipe your finger and access to the applications which are on the top side on home screen also now we have an updated shelf on oxygen os 12 and to trigger oneplus shelf now we have a gesture of swiping from the right top corner this will trigger oneplus shelf so it's completely redesigned and the scout feature have also been implemented in the shelf itself instead of app drawer so previously on oxygen os 11 we had this scout feature which we used to find it in the app drawer and as i told you guys about the material you here you can also see the color of keyboard which have adapted to the wallpaper color let me change the wallpaper and show you guys another change what you guys gonna notice is the new and redesigned wallpaper section so let's apply a static wallpaper we'll apply this i just wanted to show you guys the material you part on google applications and if i go and open keyboard here you can see the keyboard have now adapted to the wallpaper color. Though we don't have any dedicated feature of wallpaper based theming on Oxygen OS 12, this feature we get to see on Color OS. And also guys, camera part will be reviewing in a review video, so stay tuned for that. In a review video, we'll try to cover almost every topic including camera, performance, battery backup and other stuff. So if you have any kind of questions or queries, then just drop them in the comment section. We'll answer all your queries in the review video. So there are lot many UI changes what OnePlus have done with Oxygen OS 12 compared to Oxygen OS 11. 
though these are not major ones but yes slight changes have been done here the complete settings page have been redesigned few minor changes have also been done in the quick setting panel and if you guys want to know all the ui changes and difference between oxygen os 11 and oxygen os 12 then watch the video which is being displayed on the screen with oxygen os 12 now we get this high performance mode which can be enabled while multitasking or playing heavy games though this will consume more battery and that's the reason oneplus have now added a high performance mode by default it is is disabled and your device will not consume more battery until unless this feature is triggered after oxygen os 12 update you guys will obviously notice bit of improvements in the haptic feedback on your device and now let's also check fingerprint unlock and face unlock feature whether both of them are working fine or not so fingerprint unlock and face unlock works as expected and it has similar speed what we get to see on oxygen os 11 we do get the support of 100 mode on oxygen os 12 and that can be triggered from the system settings here we have 100 mode and also in past many users had always requested for theme store and oneplus have finally added the same on oxygen os 12 from where you can try out many great themes most of them are paid but still you guys can try them out for free for five minutes if you like those themes you can just make a purchase and all the themes are not that costly you can get most of the themes at just 30 or 40 indian rupees so as you can see here we have applied one theme and which is free for five minutes trial so there are many themes present here on this theme store and i'm sure people who are more into customization and giving their device a unique look they will obviously like this feature after that oneplus have also added the ram expansion feature on oneplus nord which can be found in the about section so here you can see my device is 8 gb ram variant and i can expand ram up to more 5 gb which will be in total 13 gb but i personally never found this feature useful on any of my smartphone and i guess this feature is temporary because initially we also got this feature on oneplus 9 series but later it was removed after that in the gestures we have a bit of add-ons i mean to say full screen gestures where you get this option to switch to previous app so if you're using full screen gestures and you swipe and hold for a few seconds you'll see the icon of the application which you previously used soon you release the gesture that app will be opened and it's kind of useful feature with open beta 1 oneplus have also added the smart battery engine which can help us get more battery backup on our device for the battery backup i cannot comment anything right now i'll be using this device as my primary phone for a day or two and later we'll update you guys about the same in a review video and with oxygen os 12 finally oneplus have added different modes in dark mode so here you can see soon you enable dark mode you go to dark mode settings here we have three options which is gentle which gives you this grayish color then medium followed by enhanced and we also have an adaptive contrast which will automatically adjust the screen color contrast according to the ambient lighting condition one of the best implementation on oxygen os 12. later oneplus have also updated this work life balance mode i personally have never tried this feature so if any of you guys use this feature do let me know what all changes they have done with this new version of work-life balance gallery app have also been updated to the latest one which also supports this pinch in and pinch out feature with two fingers and this is also ai powered which can automatically recognize the picture quality and crop accordingly until now i don't see any kind of delays in loading the photos in this gallery app on my oneplus nord after that let's go to settings and here we have the personalization section which is completely redesigned on oxygen os 11 i guess this was called customization here we have a completely redesigned ui where you can enable always on display you have canvas aod 2.0 so let me select a picture and with this updated version of canvas aod we get few options to customize and make changes between paint brushes color palettes and special effects and this feature seems to be working fine on my oneplus nord let me show you that and here you can see i'm not sure whether you guys are able to see but canvas aod works pretty much fine on my oneplus nord later we have three different colors for horizon light few more fingerprint animations under always on display now the clock styles have been properly segregated for analog we have a different column and for digital we have a different column also for aod styles you can choose between canvas bitmoji and insight 
So now talking about the gaming part, OnePlus have also updated their game space application which can be triggered either from the right top corner or you can swipe from the left top corner. And here OnePlus have added performance settings where you can use three different modes. One is low power mode, second one is balance mode and the third one is pro gamer mode for heavy games like Battlegrounds Mobile India. And this also supports voice modular where you can choose different in-game voice while interacting with your teammates. And one great thing which I would like to appreciate, OnePlus have added high Hyper Boost Gaming Engine on this build of Oxygen OS 12 for OnePlus Nord. This feature was exclusive for OnePlus 10 Pro and Color OS and it's nice to see Hyper Boost on OnePlus Nord. And we might expect this feature on other OnePlus smartphones in upcoming days with Oxygen OS 12. And let me tell you guys what is Hyper Boost Gaming Engine. So basically this includes stuff like GPA Frame Stabilizer, OSYNC and many other stuff like faster loading of games. GPA Frame Stabilizer helps to maintain stable frames while gaming and OSYNC is designed to increase the sync speed between processor and display by almost 3 to 6 times. OSYNC works with games like PUBG and Legends of Leagues and this feature also overclocks the response time by 30 milliseconds which can be very helpful in competitive games. As said, gaming performance will be covered in review video. Meanwhile, we'll be testing out how much difference does this hyper boost gaming engine creates while gaming. So stay tuned for that. And now talking about some of the issues which you guys can face on Oxygen OS Open Beta 1 and one of them is layer 2 keyboard so whenever you open keyboard for example let's open keyboard here and OnePlus says that left bottom side button can disappear as you can see here right now the button is not visible when I open keyboard and also OnePlus says that there are possibilities that you won't be able to browse, delete, download pictures from cloud. So till now I haven't faced any kind of issues using the cloud services and also guys you don't have to worry as it's a known bug which OnePlus have mentioned. Also OnePlus have mentioned that personal safe might not work but let's give it a try whether it works on my device or not. For us private safe seems to be working fine but there are possibilities that you guys might face some or the other issue with private safe. So guys this was a complete look on Oxygen OS 12 for OnePlus Nord and I won't recommend you guys to update your device right now. Wait for our complete review video. After that you can decide whether to update your device to Oxygen OS 12 or not. As of now only this much in this video. I hope you guys gonna like the video. If you like the video then do give me a thumbs up and also if you are new to our channel then do not forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching have a great day